all right hey what's up guys it's your boy Pisces Pino here and I love as always thanks for watching this video any other videos on my youtube channel so here we got we had leaking problems right here and look at this the joint is not sitting correctly so we came and went to home depot and got one of this slip joint and washer right so i guess that's the problem we're gonna try to fix it if this is too short we're gonna try to um buy a new one or well, we actually have a new one and well we don't have the correct size for this so we're gonna have to actually replace this but it's not too 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 my too wide of a mount so that's why we gotta try to get this right well, you're doing a YouTube video yeah Oh, and guys, I'm playing some PUBG. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so we're gonna start. We're gonna get this. So basically, is what you need is just this, right? You open it up. So there's two O-rings, I mean rings, and then there's a larger one, and there's a smaller looking one. So that's why it it makes a difference between that so if the other old one does not sit correctly how uh, this one is this one is skinnier as it is all right so this I mean, basically you know lefty loose is a little bit right here wearing gloves because all that you know nasty I mean, not really nasty see it's kind of loose and all this this stuff right here is not that good so that's why we want to take it out Right, we got this catchment system. So we got, oh, oh my gosh, it's all. Right. Can you, can you give me a paper towel, guys? I'm gonna just wipe it off a little bit, so it doesn't. That's why you wear gloves, because you don't know what if there's water or what that's leaking here. Kind of stinks that way. So I would change this whole thing to <coughs> Let's move the chair around a little bit Hopefully the camera doesn't fall Whoa, okay It's just balancing on a couple of legs So I mean this is basically simple, easy Just to see if that If this holds, then it'll be good, alright? and we don't need to to buy this so that's why we just got this in case because i'm thinking it's a little too short that's why they it doesn't hold so somebody's supposed to have cut it like way past right here in order to have done that all right so if i were to do it i would have to cut it longer and then that but we'll see if this one holds and it doesn't leak anymore so you want this so this old one is this kind of stuff so it is broken because see right here we got this slip oh okay sorry about that that's kind of nasty <laughs> that's why but it's cracked that's why it's it's not good all right so that's cracked right there it's not holding as correctly so this one would match this good one right here so go to home depot lowe's uh whatever um hardware parts stores you guys are close to so that's how it is all right now it's you want to put this one first right so this one first and then you want to set this right this one's supposed to set it's supposed to actually be backwards that's why it's supposed to seat right here all right and it goes up right here so that's why let me grab my phone. All right, so it's supposed to seat right here, so it blocks the water, right? So oh, that's kind of really dirty. Pour some Clorox in there. All right, and after after it goes up, it should tighten. That's why it doesn't leak. So it doesn't leak, but it was le leaking right here. All right, so let's see if this in. It sits right there. So you want to test it out. So you can see the proper sealment, so it looks good all around, all right? That's how it's supposed to sit properly, and it goes like that, like so, all right? So now I'm going to put this back on, and see 
this one works, right? So once once that, I'm gonna sit it back that way. Put this up, put this here. Make sure it is properly seated, so that's why that's the key. And it grabs here. Wait, first of all, we wanna try to test this out. Test this out to see it actually goes on correctly. See, it goes on good, right? You don't need any Teflon because, I mean, for safety wise, yeah, I would probably put, since it's water, we'll, we'll just put, we'll just put Teflon there. Get, get rid of some of this juju stuff. Just wipe it a little bit more. Just extra protection so it doesn't leak. So this this is gonna turn this way. So you wanna thread it the opposite way. So when you cut it, it'll it'll thread. Yeah. So we thread it this way. Right? I guess they never really fixed that. I mean, I would probably fix this if it's really bad, but it's not. It's not leaking from here entirely. So. That's why we'll just take this, go around once. And twice, that should be good. Just to have it a nice seal. All right, so once you thread it, it locks, locks tight. So that's how you always wanna thread your What did I what, what did I just say? Thread seal. <laughs> seal tape. Teflon. Teflon tape. There we go. Alright. See there's two, remember? There's a thick one and then there's this one. See this one? Seats. Kind of okay. But this one. Okay, which one was better? Which one did I try? This one? So a thicker one instead of this pipe looking one that just goes like that. I mean, I'll, I'll choose this one. We'll see how this one works. All right. See the difference? This one has a little safety protection, but this one has a groove, so. All right. Put it this one. And this one. that way we'll put this first we'll lift this up okay make sure it's nice and sealed around and put this here and then you because it's possibly able to lock it it goes down and it grabs it see and it's slipping so that means it's not the right one. I tried this one. Put this up. This way, it's locking that, it's supposed to lock it completely, have a complete seal. So it's dropping from here. I wonder if, wait, if that causes it to be short. Okay, you just want it snug, right? 
here. See how, how it angles a little bit? I don't know how if it's supposed to be that short. But next fix okay. So we're gonna try run some water. So it looks like there's no lead. We'll, we'll just find out a little later. Kind of feel the water a little running here. So it's not sitting up straight. No leak here. So definitely we know that this part is still good up here. That the seal is just coming from here, right? So the seal looks good. It's not leaking from the top. Had this sign right here. Please do not use this side of sink. Right? So it looks good. All right. So that's basically how you guys change the um, P trap. What's it just call it, right? For the sink slip joint and nut nut washer. I mean, if you guys have to change this one up here, then you would need a bigger plumbing wrench. Maybe I say this like two two inch two inch because this is only one one and a half. See, this is only one and a half one and one half diameter so I would get a two inch wrench plumbing wrench and then get that alright so thanks for watching guys this is your boy Pais Pino as always you guys have a great one thanks for watching see you guys in the next one on this informative stuff hopefully it help you guys out and you guys don't have a leaking sink thanks for watching peace out this is your boy Pais Pino I'm out alright oh.